to have you back. So then, did you all hear about that Arasaka aircraft? That's why the locals were all wearing wellies. <laughs> Puddles around the air. <laughs> this is a test of the Gore-Tex trainers. Ooh. Ooh. I reckon it probably is worth investing in Gore-Tex trainers, but I should have worn boots. Puchti, Puchti, for some bouldering. Um, we haven't done this bouldering before, so the tide's coming in. The first job is to is to actually find the place that we want to go to. bit wet or a lot bit wet hmm In, so time to um, attempt to escape before we get stuck in a key. Well, walking and scrambling seems to be okay and bouldering, so how's the calf? But it's slowly getting better basically. I had a whole week off running, then went for a run, it was a bit sore, wasn't too stiff the next day, so now I'm back to running every other day. But it's just a shuffle. The bonus of me running at a very gentle shuffle is it's probably a bit too slow for you. Ah, right. I got this way. Can we get around there? It's a famous big puddle. I don't know if I've ever seen it this deep. 
That's cool. Yesterday's sunny bouldering was basically one sunny day out of a big run of rainy days before and after. This is great, I am loving this. I've got two days in work this week and then I'm off for Christmas for a couple of weeks and Covid infections in South Wales are on a sharp rise so the schools are getting shut down so the kids will be homeschooled from Monday This is fine. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> That's only a little stream. And there's more. This We finished the cross country bit. This is supposed to be the road now. Because we've grown up, we're not allowed to do that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 